Wait, wait, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Okay, okay. Hi! Uh, remember at the beginning of the year when I posted a video that was like, that the response was like, Ah, Sean's quitting YouTube. He's never coming. No. Um, remember I put up that video and I was like, hey, I need to prioritize and organize my life because last year at this time, I was kind of hoping that this online identity could earn me a living. Now I'm reconsidering. Um, this has nothing to do with that. <laughs> I'm bringing it up because um, one of the things that I've adapted to uh, with my new mindset and my new uh, set schedule at work is that there are certain days that I don't produce videos, period. Like, I have set them aside as time that I spend maybe video-related stuff, but not actually producing videos. Sunday is one of those days, because I work a 10-hour shift, and I don't want to wear myself out by doing anything. Now, I say that, hey, Mike Cord, you're in the shot. Get out of there. I say that as I'm producing a video right now, but it's just a vlog. It doesn't count, right? Anyway, since I'm not producing videos, I'm cleaning up my desk. It looks much better. I, I still don't want to show you it because it's still messier than I want it to be. But I found something. I found this. I, I'm so sorry, Chris. So I mentioned... Uh, let me get my big fat head out of the way so that it can focus. Does that work? There we go. So my friend Chris, who I featured on Five Things uh, months ago, has his own Lego site. There it is. Da, da, da. Bricks on the dollar. It's at facebook.com slash bricks on the dollar. It is uh, located on the largest Lego merchant focus website that there is, um, which now off the top of my head, I'm not thinking of it. It's like Bricklink. Brick, that sounds right. Anyway, I put him on my show, and uh, his own little way of saying thank you was to send me me. This is this is this is mini me. I think he's got the hair right, and I mean, how are you going to go wrong with the body? Because every Lego body looks like that. But I got to say that shirt. I don't know. It's a it's a little uh, My Chemical Romance. What do you think? Focus. As long as my big fat head is in the picture, it just wants to focus on... Oh, wait. I have a slider. Whoop! Hey, there we go. Yeah, anyway, that shirt... It's a little emo kid. I don't know. I'm sure it's the, the best thing that he had. I could have been a spaceman. Anyway, if you're into Legos and you like to, to look at uh, what's available online in the uh, aftermarket dealings. No, they're not aftermarket. They're just like third party. Uh, check out his uh, his merchant website. He's shipped all over the world. I think he's shipped to almost every state in the United States. Maybe he hit every state at this point, but he's shipped to dozens of countries uh, it, and he's got all kinds of great stuff. When I talked about getting my dad, um, <clears throat> I got my dad a an architecture book by not by, but about Frank Lloyd Wright for Christmas. He sent me a link to their like official Frank Lloyd Wright uh, Lego sets that are very, very expensive. Very expensive. And of course, blah, blah, now Minecraft has Legos. <laughs> so that you can play with your digital blocks in an analog world, I guess. Anyway, I just wanted to say thanks to Chris, and I'm going to put this up on my shelf right here. And now I can forget about it. I mean, now I can, um, now I've talked about it. Thanks, Chris. See you guys later. Click!